They may have just beaten the Warriors last week, but they are still struggling overall. 16 point loss to the Mavericks on Saturday night and just they just keep losing close games. I want you guys to take a look at this graphic. The Thunder, despite adding Mello, Paul George, can you get the graphic up? Graphic, graphic. There we go. There it They're 0 and 9 in games Ooh. decided by eight points or fewer. That's the most such losses in the Yikes. league. A and look, Kevin, mm. the Thunder are the number two overall team in the league defensively. Yes, that's a good sign. So, yeah. look, with, what, what's with, happening here? With the exception of like the 0809 Celtics, I mean, when you concentrate all these high usage players, it, it as Eric Spolster famously said in 17 straight press conferences in 2001, <laughs> it takes time to gel. There's a lot of my turn, your mm -hmm. turn, uh, pick up basketball, and I, I, they haven't really like gelled into a coherent offensive system. I'm willing to be patient. And look, you can ride that defense for a while. I mean, are we? I mean, is anyone here going to say that this will be a worse offense on in March than it is today? Yeah. I'm going to say no. Go out on a limb there. Look, I mean, I watched that game against the Warriors taught me one thing, and that they are going to be just fine if they play defense like this. Steven, like absolutely. everything is going to flow from their defense when they get that as an identity and stop worrying about who's has the ball to have how many shots they're taking or who's taking the last shot, like they're going to be just fine. Because I think, I actually think that can be their identity. They're so long and I mean, they're, they're so they're playing great aggressive. defense. It just kind of falls apart at the end of games. You talk to Sam Presti a lot. Yep. There is a question here of whether they would be buyers or sellers at the trade deadline because yeah. on the one hand, you don't want to let Paul George That's just right. walk out the door for nothing the way Kevin Durant did. On the other hand, maybe they need to bolster their team and at the trade I don't even deadline think they're, if they're in going that, to get like you can't even bring that up. You can't even bring that subject up with him right now. Like like that's not, that's a forbidden conversation, right? That is like a we are not even close to looking at that glass let alone breaking that glass. That glass right? is there though, it, right? It's, okay, you it's may frosty. see it, I may see it. I it's don't think anybody else frosty. is going to see cuz they are going to have the absolute longest possible look at this as they possibly can. I, I, and I, I don't just mean Paul, I mean Mello too. Yeah. And, and I think they're in the place where it's like, you've got to give Russ some time to organize this. Because, you know, Russ, is, Russ has that quality like LeBron does where give him three or four weeks to figure this stuff out. Like yeah. he generally tends to settle into things. It's November. I mean, yeah. it's, it's, it's easy to forget that. We're, um, we're I think you like got to roll quarter the, the season in, not even, which, like, is, yeah. which is something, but not everything, right? And you got to so roll the dice. So you're just sort of like, there. hey, where are we? And, and kind of know that their their time is shorter maybe than everyone else, but also know the expectation. Yeah. It's a little bit of a luxury to play in the conference with Golden State because as much as you want to say we are competing for that title, we are competing to be the ones who get that finals berth, nobody's going to declare your season yeah. a failure if you lose in the Western Conference Finals to Golden State. Yeah, State last year it was Golden State. Remember when it, it took a little while for Steph and KD to learn to play together. After that Christmas game, Steve mm -hmm. Kerr goes over to Steph's house for three hours and they, they have a big long heart-to-heart -heart about how he needs to play because they were both being too nice and all that. I, look, it's it's so early. I don't think we we worry about it. And I do think there's a little regression to the mean going on here. Yeah. Like they were so good look, last their year. Their point in the differential is yeah. one of the top in the Western Conference, it's, and I believe there's in a lot stuff. of good stuff. Their passing, I believe, is near the bottom of the conference overall, and so that's something that I think will need to change.